bro. Hold on. Let me tell you about this hot chocolate, bro. This shit from Quick Check, this shit is um white chocolate caramel hot chocolate. White chocolate caramel hot chocolate. With a splash of Hershey caramel creamer. Bro, this shit is like crack. Ah, this is fine. So wait, is, is there any milk in there? The creamer, that's it. If that counts as milk, that shit mad sugary though. Ah, I don't know, might might do some of my insides. I don't I know, know. I, that creamer be that creamer be done up. I forgot you fucking lactose intolerant <laughs> and shit. But yo yo yo, welcome back to another episode of my No Regrets podcast, and I'm here with my brother, man. And I just want y'all to know, you know, I be having a lot of my my family out on this um podcast but this man right here but this is really my brother for real i'm not gonna lie hell yeah bro but you know i just want to i just want to say one thing bro you know throughout all these years bro when growing up when you know i'm trying to find my way trying to find my friend group and shit like that you was always there with me by my side bro hell yeah bro through all the times when we was in middle school to the time when you freaking cut your hand open in <laughs> seventh grade math class when we used to go to the um football field to play with the white kids Yo. Like I like in high school, bro. Like I used to try to find like my friend group. I didn't know who it was. I didn't know it wasn't like the basketball team, but you was always there, bro. Yeah, bro. Cause like, yeah, bro. Growing up, you know, shit was it was cool where we was at and all. But like we met through basketball and shit. But like we was always good friends. Even yeah, just math class, bro. Yeah, that's all I'm saying. It was just just clicked from there on. Then we played ball, and then it was just like there that's all I'm saying, out, bro. bro. Like, you always have a special place in my heart, bro. Hell yeah, you know, you're my looks, brother. my guy. You know, you're my brother, bro. And, bro, I got, I got a special present for you. You know, it was your birthday, like, a month ago, right? Yeah, bro. You know, I've been working, oh, my nigga. Oh, man, yo. Why, Happy why birthday. You got to go over here spending this breezy for, bro. You don't got to do that, bro. It's not the breezy, bro. It's just, you know, don't look at the price tag. It's not really the... Chill, cuz. You fuck with it? I was, nah. Oh, this is hard. I was like, you know what? <laughs> yeah. Yo, good looks. You know, I got good you, looks. my brother. You know, I got this you, my brother. Hard. Good look. Of course. I appreciate that. I wasn't about to go to that store. I was about to go to that other store that we'd be going to in um New Brunswick, that vintage yeah. place. But that shit was closed. Yeah, bro. Like, I think they was renovating that shit. I went all the way over there. I was like, you know what? I'm like, all right, what's the next place? I was like, oh, dang. Ever since the vid, bro, it's just everything be closing at weird times, especially these, these clothing places. Because yeah. most of them are like small businesses and like people own them and stuff. But I think that place is going up. I ain't going to lie. Yeah, no, nah, they are, though. Like, I be seeing them. Like, I haven't seen them in a while. I look on their page. I'm almost like, they got like 100K now. And I think they was like renovating stuff, making it all nice. I was like. Hold on, and I went to client. Yo, clientele, that should look nice as hell now. Yeah, but low key, I know, I know that shit's that shit's hell expensive. I mean, it was expensive then, but nah, nah, it, they be taxing everything. They upped bro. it, like, bro. That's why I was copping hella heat in the summer, and then I, I ain't cop, I ain't cop nothing after that. Bro, I seen they had a fish tank in there. Yeah, I was like, what? I'm like, hold on, and plus, I got that shit on sale too. Word. That shit was like, I think it was like eighty bucks. But, like, the shoes in there, bro, that shit was, like, 500 Like, you know, I ain't going to spend $500 on some shoes. I ain't going to lie, bro. I feel that, bro. I feel that. Like, I'm seeing the jackets. I was going to get you one of them little anti-social hoodies at the other place because it'd be, like, $80. Over there, that shit was, like, 250 Bro. Like, what's wrong with these clientele niggas? Bro, I bought, I bought a hoodie, that one anti-social from there. It was one something. One? One, one something. But that was before they... They did the store over and stuff. Oh, at the... It was the smaller store before that. Oh, okay, that okay. That little place, but... Nah, yeah, they... they bro. They up the prices up in there now. It's they max. be... I, I got a question, bro. Yeah. So, like, even though these shoes be 500 like, you know what reps are? Uh, yeah. What, like... like the replica replace, shoes? Re, oh, rep, rep shoes. Like, the shoes that they're, like... They're so-called, like, fake, but they look exactly like normal shoes. All right. All right, yeah. Give me an example. I know exactly All right, so what you're say, talking about. Say like Jordan fours, right? Like the like Are you the talking Travis about like them, oh, like like them Air Kai's. No, like, they're, they're not like, like those? nah. This they're literally they look like they're the same shoe, but, but it's just fake. Technically, they're fake. So they're replicas of those shoes. Like, what are your thoughts on yeah, that? Yeah, but that's but I mean, my thoughts on that is 
I mean, it's a replica, yeah, but like, nah, this that's not really. They're not like valid. That that's technically fake. Cause yeah. like, it's, if it's not from the company, it's it's not. It's that's not what I'm real. saying. But like, think about it, bro. They are they're made the same way yeah, that the I company know. makes it's it. It's just I know it's just really. I it still is. buy them shits. I ain't yeah, gonna lie I, to you. <laughs> I swear to God. It depends. I mean, yeah. Like you gotta give me. I need a. Uh, All right, Yeezy slides. I right, can. Yeah. I'll buy a rep of yeah, Yeezy slides yeah. for like fifty beans, yeah. bro. Yeah, that's true. I mean, yeah. Nowadays, more people people just want it for, for bro. what it is, the name like, and stuff. But you could get, yeah, you can get hella, hella stuff for like, yo, them. How much are Yeezy slides nowadays, bro? Like fifty, bro. Yeah, they come out when they, they like sixty dollars retail, I think. But then they sell for like two hundred plus. After. Like you crazy? As hell. I ain't buying those slides for two hundred dollars, bro. Yeah, <clears throat> bro. I'm low key trying. To, I'm. I could, if I can start getting that as a side hustle, like when I start making more money, I'm gonna really do that. What sell shoes? Just yeah, or just like anything in general. Like I low key want like a clientele store, like hey, like that bro. shit. Just sell anything, like shoes, shirts. Just you can start with something small though. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, I want to soon. I just want to get more money. Like it'll be like a side first, and then I'll probably build it up. Mm. Hey, but buddy, yeah, you can buy fire. some replicas for $50. <laughs> I get nah. some Travis Scott Fours for $50 and sell them shits out. They, they're they exactly the same, but they're nice. just not made by Jordan, bro. Yeah. I'll do that shit. They got me up. That but, is true, though. But nah, see, with this, with my podcast, I was thinking, like, you just asked me before. He was like, yo, so what's, like, the next step after, like, when you keep doing your podcast? I'm like, you know, I don't know. But I was thinking, like, maybe I might do, like, a clothing brand, like, make, like, like, you know, shirts and like jumpsuits. Yeah, bro, do that because I'm like, trying. Like, we we making a dynasty with this thing, bro. Bro, anything could be really. That's the thing about nowadays. Like, anything could really just be made to money, bro. Like, that's what it anything, is nowadays. Bro. Just everything's like selling, like a selling market. Like, that's what I'm saying, bro. You can do anything you want, bro. Yeah. Like with this, I think when you hit 10k on TikTok, you can start making money. Word. Bro, we almost there, bro. If y'all don't know, follow us on TikTok and no regulars. We almost had 10K. We had like 9,100 something, bro. We up. Hell Told yeah. Told you, bro. The mafia up, bro. <clears throat> but yeah. Oh, let me tell you a story that happened today, bro. Hell yeah. Something, something embarrassing, bro. I, I did ass. Damn. All right. All right. <laughs> Look, I, I did bad. I did bad. I did bad. All right. Thank God this wasn't in the middle of campus because I would have been the talk of the, that. It was bad. Mm-hmm. So, you know the scooters, right? Yeah. Remember them scooters we did on Cali? So we have those in Newark now, right? So I'd be riding yeah, be it to them. I'd be riding it to like class and to the dome and stuff. I busted my ass today, bro. <laughs> bro. Like <laughs> Bro, for real. Yo, bad. Like my knee still hurts. Like I tumbled, like rolled <laughs> Yo. Le- like legs in the air type type ish, bro. Wait, you had your book bag and stuff? I had my book bag on. So like this is what happened, right? So I'm riding on the street. And I'm by the curb, and then a late, it's a one way street, and it looked like a lady's trying to do a K turn, and she moved over. So I'm like, oh, I hop off, and I'm like riding it on the side and walking at the same time. And then I hop <laughs> back on, right? And then I go onto the onto the sidewalk, and then I hit a curb, like a rock, and my shit go left. And I, I jump off, and I trip, and I fell. I land on my knee, and like I did a whole roll, bro. I Yo. swear to God, bro. <laughs> and like I was so mad. I, I just got up. And just act like nothing happened. Just left. Yo, yo, I was so pissed, bro. Like that, bro. That shit. It was cold as hell today, too. Yes, I bro. Away. It was cold. I was hell. tearing up. That's how the yo. wind was smacking me in my face, bro. That shit made me tear bro, up. Bro, you said no one seen. Bro, how did no I, I one don't, see? I don't that? know. <laughs> I don't know. The, wait, wait. The lady. So wait, the lady that did that, bro. She ain't even checked to see if you was good. She I don't just think kept she driving. I don't think she peeped. Oh, she bro. peeped you. Cause like I was already I was a little further ahead. Oh yeah. So yeah, and then yeah. there was two ladies next to me that was like that she seen me almost get hit by the car. She's like, oh oh, but I don't, they probably dead seen that. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> like I'm not go. Like I just went like a blank. I'm like yo, and I'm riding. I'm like yo, did that really just happen? Like yo, yo I did just bust my ass in front of like it. Like it was it was it wasn't on a busy street. It was on like a little quiet street and like there wasn't really cars passing by. So I was like, ah, I'm straight. <laughs> but that was so bad. But like I had never fall like that in my life. Bro, I ain't gonna lie. When we were doing them in Cali, bro, I was so scared that was gonna happen because they be going. That's fast what I'm saying. It'd be like the littlest or the smallest, the smallest thing could just you on that school or you going flying. That's what I'm saying, <laughs> bro. Them you things really go like going flying. The ones I don't know how fast the ones in Cali went, but the one I was on it only goes up to like 15. 
But still, even that's that's pretty fast when you're on that, like that little thing. Don't and you if have you go one? downhill, bro? Yeah, you can go like twenty downhill. Like, like how fast does yours go? Cause I know you have a scooter, right? Yeah, that's. I think that go probably a little faster than that. Like what? Probably like twenty. Like no. Oh, okay, cap. okay, okay. I thought you go to say like thirty or something. Nah, shit, bro. nah. But they got those. But nah, them shits is hella expensive. Bro, like I busted my ass, bro. Like, I don't think... Do they got the bikes or no? Nah? nah, they don't got no bikes. No, they, the they... bikes the bikes was the best. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I was going like 30 on those downhill, bro. The bikes was max. Them shits was fun. I don't think we're going to get bikes until like another two, three years, Probably bro. not. Because like, they only have like, like 20 have scooters, many, bro. Yeah. And it's only around like Newark, like uh, Rutgers, Newark. You can't even bring them up to NJIT. Dang, like, they, they stop. They stop. Yeah, they stop as soon as you pass the border. It's like, dang. But I'm like, yo, that was embarrassing. That was so bad. <laughs> That's like crazy. that was that was up there one of my embarrassing moments. Remember, remember the time we was in um, we was coming, we was walking from the Y. Yo, <laughs> I knew you were about to say that, bro. I knew you were about to say bro, that. Bro, that's the reason why. Yo, I, honestly, I would rather break a bre- break a bone than like get a gash on my leg after that incident. Yo, do you remember? You remember what yo, happened, right? Oh yeah, bro. Right, <laughs> so let, let me tell you what happened, right? So, so me and Ish go when we was kids. We used to go to the YMCA in um Roselle. So there's a street, and me and Ish we used to go walk up the street to go to 7-Eleven, right? Hell yeah. So we was walking to 7-Eleven. It was snowing. And then I just got finished working out. And then Ish tried to test my gangster. He was like, yo, because <laughs> I'm saying like I could jump over a chair without running. He's like, nah, you can't do that shit. I'm like, yeah, I'm like, yeah I can. He's like, all right. He's like, all right, jump over that thing right there. It was like a, it's like those little metal barriers that they put in the yo. ground so nobody drives over. He's like, yo, jump over that. No, no uh, running. I was like, I bet. I jumped, I tripped, and I scraped my leg so Yo, bad, bro. Straight shin first, bro. Shin first. Like, that was, like, the deepest gash I ever seen in my life. It was so bad. I didn't even get no stitches, bro. It took a whole summer to heal. You know that? Bro, yeah, you did have that. Yeah, I still forever. got the scar on my leg, bro. This is disgusting. Bro, because, like, bro, you jumped on it, and it's, like... <laughs> it was snowing, It didn't too. even, like, look like nothing happened. Like, <laughs> like... Like it ate you, bro. Like, That's what I'm saying. The barrier bro. was just there, bro. That I'm shit like, hurts yo, so. He's on the floor, just like, damn, bro. That <laughs> shit hurts so bad, bro. Like, <clears throat> oh my god. I, like I used, I had to wear a bandaid every day. Yeah, I think about that. I was like, yo, my shin. That shit probably would have sliced in half. Bro. You would, you might have broke your leg. I ain't yeah, gonna lie. <laughs> I, my legs would have been broke. Yeah. My legs would have been done for. You ever had any embarrassing moments, bro? Something crazy. I had another one that was bad. Oh, hell yeah, bro. So, on my old street, before I lived where I live at now, I used to live um by that Bank of America on Morris Ave. Oh, no, what you're talking that about. That street, that yeah. dead end, like, right down there. I used to live down there. Bro, I don't know what happened to me, but, like, bro, <laughs> I ran myself over with, like, my own bike, bro. <laughs> like, no cap. So, like, I'm going down. I'm going down. You ran the yourself hell. over. Yeah, bro, because, like, I fell in front of it, and, like, the bike kept going a little <laughs> bit. So it's like, I low-key, yeah, I, like, ran myself over, bro. So I'm going down the mountain, like, the little hill, and, like, my brakes is pretty good, so I'm not scared. I'm going fast and stuff. But, like, my brakes is mad good, bro. My <laughs> brakes is mad good. So then I'm, like, trying to stop, like, right before I hit my house, and then, like, same thing. I think I hit like a little rock or something, but like, did you fall over your bike? Yeah, like I fell on like the side. <laughs> so then like my side like turned into like the front, and I ended up in front of the bike, and like that shit ran. Bro, that you shit over. like kept going. <laughs> like, it like ran over me fast though, so it was like pew. Did you have like scrapes and shit? Yeah, I had I had hella scrapes. It was I think I got the scars still. That shit's on my elbow, on my knee. Oh my god. Remember, you remember when Javon fell down the hill on his bike and he came back like fifth grade, like his face was all messed up? Yo. I thought he got hit by a car. I was talking That's, about the Fritz. Yo, yeah, nah. Because you remember nah, that? he looked crazy. Bro, I felt bad. I was like, oh, dang. Cause I, think I you- thought some max happened to him. <laughs> like somebody sliced him up or something. Like, Yo, bro. That's funny as hell. But- nah, it's crazy. Freak accidents is... Is really serious, bro. I used to, I used to fall on my final bike all the time. Final destination is real, bro. You said final destination is real. Yeah, bro. Like them freak accidents, bro. <laughs> like that randomness of dying could really happen. Yo, I be seeing like videos on TikTok. It's like 
weird ways of, of somebody dying and shit like that. And freaking, do you think somebody ever died from the like you ever watched in Final Destination with the ele- escalator? What I think what happened. What I think happened? the escalator broke. And like some girl got her leg caught in it, and it was just like <laughs> chomping her up. All right, bro. all right, all right. It might not go down like that, but definitely, if like a a little baby get get caught in there, <laughs> yo, I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna lie. He he might just go, he might just go. <laughs> but like, but like, but like a person, bro. Nah, but it might just get a little baby. Yeah, bro. I don't know. You ever you ever you ever think a baby could get picked up by like a hawk? You think uh, that ever happened before, bro? Yo, I'm not gonna lie. I've seen videos of eagles picking up like, bro, like small dogs. Bro. I know like, they could. They def- could pick definitely up. pick up. <laughs> I don't know if it has happened before, cause maybe in the lowest of keys. Yeah, maybe it just wasn't recorded. But, on, but you just know, a- it probably happened in them them areas. You know, they have them native people and stuff. Maybe. Oh yeah, 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 maybe. yeah. Like somebody like, doing they be ass. having them giant pterodactyls over there, bro. I don't know what they be having. Hey, but. bro, they got a lot of weird stuff <laughs> over there, bro. Like, they got a lot of weird stuff over. And like speaking about like shit like that, right? So, like, what I want to talk about was you ever heard like there's a there's a theory going around. You know, national parks, right? Yeah. Like you know how like national parks is like made to like. Uh, made to like preserve the land and shit like that. Mm-hmm. There's a theory that <clears throat> national parks wasn't made to preserve the land, but to like control what's in it. Like there's something hunting us mm. down in there, bro. Because think about it like this. Damn, I never heard of that. I right. right, explain that. What, let me, is, what let does me, that mean? What's hunting us? What is wh- we're being hunted? Us? There's so called. So Teddy Roosevelt back in the days, he was a like he was our president, right? So he was mm-hmm. a hunter and he believed in Bigfoot. So. Yeah. He um he created like national parks to say to preserve the land, but really it could be to contain what's ever in there, so we could kill it instead of it just killing us if we wander into it. And the people, cause like you never seen that picture of a map of like people going missing, mm-hmm. and like you ever seen there's like a picture next to it of like <clears throat> the cave systems and how they're like like lined up low key. Yeah, they're saying like whatever lives in those caves, there's people living in those caves. They might be hunting us down, and bring them in there, bro. I don't know what it is. There's not a specific thing, but there's mad like there's a there's a thing called the 411 411 phenomenon. It was mm-hmm. a guy named um David uh Pilatus. So he's an investigator. So he investigates like he wrote four books and two documentaries about the missing people going missing in like national parks and things like that. And like some of them is just like, oh, they just wander off, get lost, fall off a cliff, mm-hmm. fuck around, die and shit, right? But there's other ones that they're walking the trail, they turn around and their man isn't there no more. And mm. they get and they find him like two miles like away somehow. Like there was a right, there's a story, mm. right? Yeah. It's a uh, a little boy. His name was um Keith Perkins. He's two years old, right? So they they live on a ranch and things like that, around like national forests and things like that. So he's Keith Perkins is a two year old infant. He's outside just playing around and his parents are watching him. They turn around and they look, and he's gone. They don't know where he went. They call up the police and investigators. They have, like, a search for him, like, 300 people. And it's, like, it's not, like, forest. It's, like, it's a forest, and there's, like, snow. So mm. they're, like, where the hell could he go? And they found, yeah. like, two miles in the into the forest, they find footprints, like, little kid footprints. But then it goes away. And then another 12 miles down, they find his. they find him. He's, like, curled up in a ball, laid face down. His hat and his jacket is neatly folded right next to him. And he has, like, scratches on his face. And all he could say was, like, oh, a cat scratched me. But they don't don't understand how he got 12 miles away from his own house. Yeah, no. And, like, they brought, like, you know the Survivor Man? I forgot what his name was. Yeah, uh, I I, I forgot. Not Bear Grylls. There's some other guy. There was, like, he was, like, all right, let's see if a human can actually do that. And he tried, like, within 20 hours, the baby so-called went a distance of 12 miles. So the guy tried to do it, like, the same path that he sh- he would have took, and he couldn't even do it. So they're saying, like, how the fuck the baby get all the way over there? Man. I'm just saying, bro. Nah, that's... Like, that's rem- that is crazy. I'm like, remember the lie. times we used to go into the woods, bro, and just go adventuring? Imagine that shit happened to us. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. We, 
I'm think I be thinking about that all the time. I'm like, yo, we're we're kind of crazy. We're kind of crazy. We're crazy guys, bro. <laughs> Remember, you almost fell we're, down that cliff, bro. And yo, I had to pick you up in Berkeley Heights. Yo. Yes, bro. That shit is scary. Yeah, you already bro. said I was about to cause a motherfucking avalanche and shit. You almost did, bro. I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> nah, bro. but like, yeah, that's nah, that's crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I wouldn't be surprised, bro. You don't know what lives in them woods. I don't. I be. I be. I be in the woods a lot too, bro. I have been since I was little. Like my dad used to take me fishing. I've been in hella woods. That's what I'm saying, bro. And I've seen lots of stuff. I've seen lots of animals. That's what real. I'm saying, bro. And like, I mean, it's not. I don't like. It's not proven right, but like, you never know. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> anything in the woods, anything really happens, bro. Like you see everything from animals. To like, crazy people, I ain't gonna lie. There'd be crazy people that just be staying in the woods, mm-hmm. like you like, know, people bruh, that do witchcraft and shit like that. Bruh, people they don't even gotta be homeless, they don't gotta be native people. It's just random weird people that live exactly. in exactly in the forest, in bruh. the forest, just nuts. Freaking <laughs> serial killers might be living in there, bro. Like, yeah, hey, you never know, bro. Freaking aliens. I don't know if aliens. Are real. <laughs> hey, bro, they say aliens. Aliens are real, bro. No, I def I definitely believe, I believe there's there's something, something extra. Yeah, I'm, I don't know, bro. Bro, what if you bro. were like, what if you were one of these, one of these people that this stuff happened to? Like, like it disappeared. Nah, not even disappeared, but like you had this, this experience that you didn't know how to explain, and you were explaining to people, and like, they didn't believe it. Yeah, well. What would you do? Like, I don't know. Like honestly, I would try. Like I would tell people. I feel like I feel like when we tell, like stuff happens like that, right? Mm-hmm. We try to, we try to, uh, we call people crazy because we don't believe them or That's we don't what know saying, what they're talking about. That's why I be talk like I be thinking like, like the people we call crazy. Like what are they telling the truth, bro? I be thinking that too. I be thinking the crazy people low key ain't crazy, bro. Even the people that. That's really, really, though. really need help. Like even the 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 mentally challenged, like bro, that them people, maybe they maybe they really do see something that we don't. That's what I'm saying, bro. Understand? Like it's like you can't. Like it's it must be mad frustrating. I'm not gonna lie. Oh yeah, I ain't, nah. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Like yeah, especially it if it be. really happened to me. Like say I got abducted. And I'm trying to tell people, like, yo, I got abducted. And, like, what the hell? They don't believe me. I'm going to be pissed off. So I'm just going to be like, you know what? Bro, I know what happened to me. I don't even know. I don't even know. Because if, if people don't really believe me, bro, that's what I'm saying. People go crazy. Like, exactly. Like, I would really do some crazy stuff if people don't believe me. If I really got abducted, bro, <laughs> bro, and niggas don't believe me, bro. You going out to the bro, streets? I'm abducting people, bro. <laughs> like, it's, it's over. Because, like, bro, it really, like... Cause like yo, that's that's crazy. Like, how do you, like, if that really was to happen, like that's what I'm saying. People be going crazy when, even even real life stuff happens. Like, something as simple as like, bro, like somebody getting robbed. Yeah, like people just go crazy and like, like they try to get back at somebody and they end up like killing mad people or something. Exa- like, oh, just so going overboard, like doing some maximum stuff. Like that's what I'm saying, bro. Like, like say somebody. Like, or bro, like, like relationships nowadays, like bro, like some people really be getting like murked out here just because they don't want to be with somebody. Like that is for true. Real. Like bro, did you hear about that 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 person in Jersey that like kidnapped his um the son? Yeah, and then he killed the his uh ex wife or whatever. I heard. Wait, was it like that guy from Rawway? Yeah, but yo, you know that guy. That guy that killed her, bro, the the lady, she was like, I heard she was the she was like talking to that to that guy that owns uh, Cook's Kitchen or whatever. Are you serious? Yeah, that you know that seafood spot yeah, that used yeah. to it's in like Menlo Mall now or whatever. It's mm-hmm. in one of the malls. I heard that was his girl that he was talking to at the moment. Oh, and she died like he killed her, bro. Yeah, because she didn't want to be with him no more. I don't know. I heard he was not trying to let her see. Like his kid and stuff, so he kidnapped the kid, the kid, and then he like drove across like Jersey and I think Penn- he drove he drove somewhere, but then yeah I he know ended he up he girl. ended up offing her, bro. Like that's what I'm saying. That's like crazy. people be going crazy, bro. yo. People you, be going crazy. You heard about that kid from our high school? Remember the kid? He had the um Louis V tat on his forehead. 
Mm-hmm. The one they say he was gay. You know he killed his girlfriend? Oh, it was him? Yes. I didn't know who it was. He killed his girlfriend, bro. Oh, he like, shot her, right? Yes, something? he shot her in the head. I, I don't know if it was by accident, but he, I guess like she, was, tra- shoot. she was trying to dip and she just murked him, bro. Like yeah, no, nah, that's what I'm saying. Like, see, bro, like people be people be maxing out, like for no reason, bro. It could be something so little, but like, that's what I'm saying. Something so little to one person so may big. mean the world to somebody else. And when somebody's world is broken, it's like you can't tell them nothing, bro. That's it's, true, bro. So hey, these documents in that 411 case that's actually real, like. It's not, they're not saying it's like paranormal, but those are actual <clears throat> real cases that happen, like explained by other people. Like, yeah, no, nah, that's. Like, there was another case with a, with a kid, bro. Like, a little kid. I forgot what his name is. I think his name was like, um, little six year old boy. Him and his father, they go out Father's Day camping in the national parks and they're playing around and stuff like that. And another guy comes up, he's like, comes up to his father, he's like, oh, you want to, can me, can my sons go play with your sons? Because they're the same age. Like, can they go play? He's like, yeah, sure. So they're all the kids playing hide and seek and stuff like that. And eventually the kids start playing hide and seek against the parents. So then he's like, all right, come outside, come out. And mind you, the, the one kid's father is still watching him just to make sure you don't get lost. Mm-hmm. And he knows where he's at. So he's like, he's behind this tree. He's like, all right, uh, I think his name was like David or something like that. David, come out, come out. And he's not coming out. And he's like, where are you? He goes behind the tree. He's not there no more. Yo, cuz ran two miles into the up the Appalachian Trail, bro. Could not find him, screaming his name out. All this, that, and third. So then, in the books, like the four hundred one books, like that, uh, this guy made. There was a case, like there was people at that same time at that same park. There was people that asked the ranger. There was like, oh, where could we go to see bears or whatever, right? Mm-hmm. It was like the ranger was like, oh, you can go here, but like be careful because there actually be bears over here. Yeah. So the people they were looking, they're just having a picnic and stuff, and they heard a scream. And this was during the time that what's his name just left. So they heard a scream and they looked at the mountainside and those were there were some trees that you could see through them. It's not I forgot what the type of trees are. They're like high trees, but you could see people running through it. And you see like a bear looking thing running through the trees, but like it's not a bear. Because you know bears can't like they're not agile like that. And it had like it looked like it had a little boy holding over his shoulder like this, but it's like dodging, dipping and dodging through the trees, oh, bro. Nah. And that literally happened an hour after the kid, they, the kid was um found like missing, bro. So oh, hour, yeah. I don't know what's in these woods, bro. But people, if y'all go camping, bro, be careful, cause if y'all get abducted. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. Yo, <clears throat> I actually seen like that was probably the scariest. That was probably this. Yo, I seen a bear. Like besides that one time, you remember when we seen that bear when we went paintballing? Yeah, 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 bro. Before that, the scariest animal I probably say I've seen, like that wasn't in a zoo, was probably like probably like a, a coyote or something. You seen like, an actual coyote? Yeah, I've seen them shits. They be like in the forest and stuff. But bro, besides that, bro, I saw a motherfucking a big ass bear when I went fishing with my dad. Really? Before, bro, bro. All right, I'm gonna tell this little story. Long story short, bro, it was me. My dad, <clears throat> my little brother, mm-hmm. bro, Basil was there, bro. Oh, wait, Basil? Yeah. Mm. And, bro, you remember Darren, bro? Yeah. Bro, oh, he was there? Yeah. Mm. Yo, most random, random ass group of people, bro. <laughs> Basil but caps it anyways, out. Anyways, bro. bro. So we going and stuff. We go to the same place. It's in like north, a little more north Jersey. Yeah. We've been going to this place for years, though, like, since I was a damn baby, like, this same little river and stuff. It's it's mad woods back there, so... What's the place called? It's, like, by what we used to go, that big lake we used to go to? Uh, no, nah, I don't know if you heard. It's called, like, Booton, New Jersey. Mm. It's, like, north-north, like, where yeah, New York is. Not not too much north. It's more, like, northwest, kind of going towards, like... PA? PA oh, stuff, okay, so okay, it's, okay. like, hella woods over there, but mm-hmm. anyways, we in the... And we was... We be going on like a boat too, so we got like a little rubber boat and stuff. Yeah, we blow yeah. it up. We got a motor and everything, so we going down the river and stuff, bro. And then like, it's kind of dark. I would say it's like right before sun sundown, like around like six. Yeah, in the summer, it's it's not even the summer. It's probably the end of the summer. So oh, so it'd be like seven thirty maybe. Yeah, 
And it's, yeah, the end of the summer type vibe. So we going down the river and stuff. And then, like, we start to hear something in the woods to, like, the right of us. But mm-hmm. we, like, in the middle of the river. So like, we like kind of far. River? I mean, yeah, it is a deep river. But, like, the banks are, like, they're not, that, they're not that far. So oh, okay, it's, like, okay, okay. probably a whole feet across. It's probably only, like, 50 feet, maybe. Okay, from okay. one side to another. That ain't but, like, that bad. We in the middle of the river, and then we hear some noises on, like, the right-hand side. Yeah. And then, like, where we go to, it's like, we be going through, like, it's a river and stuff, but, like, it be people's backyards connected to the yeah to the river and stuff. Mm-hmm. So, like, it's, like, forest and people's yards, but, like, so we hear something, and we're like, maybe it's just somebody back there walking, like, a big-ass dog, like a fucking, <laughs> like a Rottweiler or some shit. Like, that shit is, like... It's, like, bro, stomping. it's sounding, like... Trees are going down back there, but you don't see trees going down. You see stuff going down, but it's not trees. But yeah, yeah. it's enough noise that you're like, yo, what the hell is that? Mm-hmm. Bruh. So we're like, all right. Okay. And it gets louder and louder. And then, bruh, that motherfucker stands up. Like, because like, we can't. I think he was down, like, on his fours or something. Yeah. But, yo, he stands up, bruh. He's at least, bruh, I don't know. He has to be, like, at least, like, like 10 feet tall bro what Yo, the his, bear yeah big ass head bro it's like above all like the the little trees and brushes like that shit stands up and like now we just see its head we're like oh nah nah it was a big this ass bear that. this is that like was he like was it mad nah it's just it's just sitting there and it's i think it just seen us because it stood up <laughs> yeah so bro it sees us and then it just sits there. But like we're moving, but we're not going that fast. So it's yeah. like we're just coming. It's like cruising. Yeah, we're cruising, and then we're just like, yo, we're just in shock. We're just staring at that shit. Like, like nah, a big ass. We don't bear. even know what to do. You know, it was a it was a bear though. Yeah, like it. Nah, I'm out. I'm out to finish. Like, bruh. So then, bruh, it it comes out. Like we see the whole thing now. Like now it comes out. It's it's basically at the. The bank. The bank, yeah. Now yeah. we see it. That shit's standing up. Still standing up. <laughs> like, it's not on four. It's still standing up, bro. What the hell? And we're like, oh, nah. And then it it comes down, bro. As soon as we get to the other side, that nigga gets in the water, bro. Nah. Bro, dead ass. On, on me, on everything, <laughs> on everything, bro, he gets in the water and he just goes across. Like comes to our side like he was like following y'all type shit nah like so we went off to the left and then we're like about to get off my dad's like yo there's like a house on the left hand side he's about to be like yo we we thinking the bear's about to come after us (laughs) so he's telling me to like go like yo you're about to go to that house and you about to just knock on that door we about to go inside that people's house random house bruh Bro, that nigga gets in the water, swims to the other side, and like, we like, nah, we getting back in the boat. <laughs> we got back in the boat, and we just, we turned around, bro, and like, went the way we came, bro, and then. Y'all was bro, paddling? Nah, we got like a little motor, so. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We just okay. got and turned it on, and just. Dipped? Bro, he went to the other side, and he just, he just went about his day, bro. It was a big ass bear, though. Bro, he went in, literally got. Seen us, got in the water, bro. It took that nigga like two seconds to swim across. He was like, <laughs> he got in the water. It looked like he just walked across the water. Like, he went in and he was like, Nah, that's went max. to the other side in like two seconds. I was like, Yo, we wouldn't even have. If he really wanted us, bro. We wouldn't even have made it anywhere in time. Like he did that shit mad fast. Nah, that's crazy. Now bear people be underestimating how big bears are. To be honest, nah, yeah, it was. Cause them it bears was a, at the it was zoo. a black bear too. It wasn't even a oh, uh, uh, a bra- grizzly bear. It was a big ass black bear, bro. Cause them bears at the zoo don't even be that big. Cause they That's be in captivity. The ones in the wild, them motherfuckers big as hell, bro. Yo, big bro. ass head, big ass paws, bro. Bro, that was the first time I seen like, like I'm not scared of really many animals. Nah, I'm not I'm, seen a bunch, but like nah, I seen that. I was like, yo, I don't even know what to do right now. <laughs> And like I've, I, I be watching Mad Animal Planet, bro. I know what bears is capable of. I know, I, I know what all animals is capable of. I'm not mm-hmm. gonna lie. Mm-hmm, and bro. I seen that thing not 
not behind a, a glass cage <laughs> it was in deep. the zoo, bro. I was, it was, that was top five scary. Mm. You know what's crazy though? Like I thought we was about to stop going there after that. Nah, we kept you we kept, kept going. We kept going back there, bro. <laughs> we just we just we just we just be prepared now, bro. We got that 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 mace, bro. Oh, the bear spray. Yo, yo, that thing is really like death, bro. Like <laughs> you thought pepper spray was bad. That shit is like twenty times worse. Yo, we sprayed it, bro. Just over the water, yo. Yo, we sprayed it over the water. There was, bro, there was fish flying up. Like, like the dying? It, 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 it like messed them up. It like stunned them, bro. Are you saying, yo? It, it was so strong, bro, like that before it even hit the water, like the fumes and stuff, the fish smelled it and was like, they weren't dying, but they were just like, some were floating up and just like flopping around the surface. And they was having a seizure type Yeah, head? and then they, they went about, but like, you know, that you shit. You think is, that could kill a person? I wouldn't say kill, but like really stun somebody. Yeah, or it, or it might mess up your your senses. Mm. That's crazy, bro. But that was like one of the scariest things, bro. Yeah, definitely. Yo, definitely, bro. That's crazy, nah. But yo, wait, what happened to Basil? Because I, I seen you had a cat now. Is Basil okay, bro? Yeah, nah. Basil's valid. He, oh, okay, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. I'm, nah, I'm nah, just making sure. Nah, bro. I, well, you thought like I got him as. Like a replacement, like yeah, something happened to Basil. Got, I thought you got a new cat, like a new pet, cause yeah. Basil was done up or something. Yeah, yeah, nah, nah, he's he's valid. Why'd you get a cat for, bro? I'm not gonna lie, it wasn't really the plan. Like, oh, like, like we 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 got we got it right, and then so like we was thinking about you know we was trying to find a place for it and stuff, but then like you end up keeping it. Hell yeah, that shit is funny as hell. <laughs> that, that, that shit is really. Really, a different is way different than raising a dog, and that shit's low key way more easier. Like she's mad smart, bro. That's like, way I, smarter than Basil, and she's only like <laughs> not even three months. Like she's mad smart. Are you she's, serious? She's Does crazy. she like be sleeping with you and stuff? Nah, I don't be letting her sleep with me. I just like we put her in the kitchen at night. Oh, okay. I don't know. She knows how to use the bathroom and stuff already. Mad quick, yo. She learned in like. Less than a week. I'm not going to lie. See, I be trying to tell Jay, like, we about to go get a bro, cat. She don't cat, want no that cat. That shit is mad easy, bro. It's just mad easy. <laughs> Told you, Yo, Jay, we, we getting a cat. Bro, so, like, she was using the bathroom at first, like, on her little bed when we first got her. Bro, we put her in the litter box, like, two days after that. Man, she Already goes knows. in there goes in there every day now. Wow. Like, she knows how to go in there, like, like she'll go all the way upstairs and if she goes to the bathroom, she knows she has to go all the way downstairs. Wow, that's tough. I ain't gonna lie. That yeah. saves a lot of time. Nah, when we brought her in, though, I thought, like, Basil was gonna, like... Be fighting her? Yeah, but, like, that little bitch be annoying the shit out of Basil, bro. <laughs> she be, like, trying to slap that nigga in the face and shit. And, like, she just be like, bro, leave me alone. <laughs> shit. Do you still have those guinea pigs? Uh, my brother, yeah, he still... Yeah, he has he, that one, right? Yeah. Okay, okay. That's funny, bro. Nah. Yeah, no, nah, that's... That's 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 a funny that's a funny pet. Bro. I need I need I might need a cat, bro. But yo, I got a question. Yo, yeah. you know Fear Factor, right? Mhm. All right, fifty k. Are you doing Fear Factor? Um, fifty k. Uh, it depends what's on the line. I'm not gonna lie. I can't. I'm not really a fearful person, but there are some things that that will get me. That would get me there. Like pretty what? scared. <laughs> like uh, what? I like I don't think anything I could... to do with really, 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 really uh like heights. Uh, I would probably be deed like something really tall if they had me like. Cause I remember I seen when they was like perched on like a building and it was just a like, harnessing. Oh yeah, they nah, got a balance on yeah, that shit. Yeah, nah, I would nah. Yeah, see anything with like that or like really, really, really dark places. Mm. But like, nah, even that. You, nah, you I think, couldn't do Fear Factor, right? Okay, okay. I ain't gonna lie, I don't think I could. I can't either. Honestly, I, I just can't do the they freaking... They be doing nasty stuff, Yeah, like too. eating, like... like all eating the like, bugs? Oh, yeah. Anything with bugs, too? Yeah, I would... Deed. I would just be like, nah, I'll quit before you even start. I'm gonna quit. <laughs> it's just not even gonna go Yo, down like that. I'm not, like... Them motherfuckers used to eat, like, cow testicles. Yeah. Raw cow... Do some weird stuff. I'm and like, then I bro, remember... This is not even fear anymore. This is just disgusting, torture. This bro. is just... 
and then, unnecessary. And then I remember, like, I don't think I could, like, I've probably failed after the first two rounds. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I think I could, like, I remember I seen one where it was like, like a stunt double type ish, and they gotta, um, like, they have to try to survive a freaking, what's it called? They're like on like a, a truck, and they have to try to get off it without it crashing. I'm like, I would def die. Or the ones where they be That's underwater. What I'm they be doing crazy. Oh, yeah. That's um, Max. Like when they're in a car and then you gotta try to get out the car, you're like submerged in water. Yeah, I can't do that. I probably would drown. Fuck around, drown, bro. Yeah, that's what I'm that's saying. That's OD. That. I don't know how whoever came up with that stuff. Sick, bro. sick, high, <laughs> high niggas on LSD. Bro. Sick people, bro. Yeah, no, that, sh- that show, that show was funny as hell though. I used to watch it though. I ain't gonna lie. This is sick, bro. Definitely crazy. But now, what? Since you said, like, your fears about heights and darkness, right? You know, mm-hmm. there's another thing. So, d- all right, do you know where we get our fears from? Do you ever, really, like, ever wonder, like, why we'd be scared of things? Or why most people be scared of certain things? Uh, I actually don't know why. Like, so, let me tell you, right? So, in our human nature, uh, we're scared of... Ma- humans are mainly scared of two things. The heights and darkness. You know why? Why? Because over the years of evolution... Like, we've learned to be afraid of those things. Because, like, say we're cavemen back in the days. Like, we don't want to go in the dark because we don't know what's in there. We might F around and die. Yeah, honestly, I'm not even going to... Yeah, that's that's really what I... I'm scared of just... I just don't... Not knowing something. Yeah, like, that's what I'm saying. Not knowing, yeah. So, like, we learned over time, like, don't go into the dark. Yeah. Don't go into the dark. And then heights. You know if you fall off the a cliff, you're going <laughs> to die. That's what I'm saying. So how could you not be scared of exactly. that, Exactly. So, like, over time, it's like we've learned to, like, not go on cliffs. But then, there's you know, there's a third thing, right? Nah, what's that? Dolls. 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 I'm not, not going to lie. I'm not scared like, of dolls. Like, there's some people that are afraid of dolls. Like, not even, like, you know... Dolls and freaking like random Bro, mannequins. You could put me in a room full of dolls. You're not gonna be scared. All them, them scary dolls, bro, from the scariest movies, bro. I'm not jacking none. You not jacking none, none of, of that, that stuff. Is, Yo, bro. you tell me, you gonna be in a room? I right, the real Annabelle doll. That shit is real. You know that, right? Put me in there, bro. <laughs> put me in. I gotta see it. Yo, I gotta see it. I seen the movies. Great movies. Great content. <laughs> I loved it. But Yo. bro, I'm not jacking that. I'm not jacking none none of that ghost controlling no dang doll, bro. I'm not. I'm not. Yo. Not saying I don't believe in ghosts. That's a different story. That's a different story. We'll get into that a little later because I got yeah. that one about. But But dolls, nah. See I feel like that's just that's just something we see, bro. Like, I feel like that too. But like you know there's some people that are like when they're young, they're afraid of dolls. Like scary looking dolls and shit. And they, Yeah, I mean I was. I mean Chucky you, was Chucky was top scariest thing I ever seen, but then I seen the movie, <laughs> I'm like, yo, what is this dumb stuff? I mean it's a good movie. It's it's good. It is. Good movie. Like the storyline and stuff is great, but I'm yeah. like, bro, this shit is not scary, bro. But but I understand though. Yeah. You know, and people got their fears. What they think about that is cause like even some kids that never watched Chucky or Annabelle, they'd be scared of dolls and they wonder why. And they'd be thinking like, what if back in the days there was a there was a thing that was like a doll, like human S but wasn't a human. Cause people be afraid of like not even dolls, just things that look like us but aren't us. Like, you know, motherfuckers are afraid of like like random figures and shit like that. They're saying like what if back in the days there was like something that was human that looked human but wasn't human, we was just afraid of that shit. So like a different species, or something, something like that. I don't know. But that's creepy as hell. I ain't gonna lie. So that would low key be aliens. Might be. They be saying. I mean, if I'm not gonna lie, you know, doesn't the word alien just mean something that we don't know what it is? They be calling. I ain't gonna lie. They be calling immigrants aliens. <laughs> I know they do. I'm like, <laughs> that's really what so it is, bro. An alien is just something that we don't know. We don't know what it is, or we don't know how to describe it. Supposedly, like, nah, I don't that's know. crazy. So, what are aliens' real name? Aliens is what the name we gave them. What do aliens call I mean, themselves? I mean, I think aliens is like a term, like you know how we're all called humans. Yeah, because there's like, like there's probably they probably have different species. Right, so, different what do aliens. people call us? What aliens call us? Yeah, exactly. They probably don't, don't call us humans. Call we us call nothing. each other humans. They probably way more advanced than us. They don't even speak. They just telepath telepathically like communicate. Communicate, right? Some weird shit, bro. Nah, that's Max. What if, what if, what if communication really moves to that? Like niggas, there's no such thing as talking. I don't. It's just, it's just like, 
just silence. I don't know, yeah, but but you know what's being said. Like I you don't know, know what bro. communication is, but it's no like nah, that'd be, that would be crazy. That'd be crazy. Like just imagine that like, we could just talk without talking. But I, like that that's how low key like don't don't like how do how do mute people be, be talking and stuff like that? Like, I don't know. What do you mean? Like people that can't talk like physically? Yeah, I know I know they have like, you know, all s- sorts of things to use, but like I don't know. People find ways when you're when you're limited on something, you find yeah, ways to do things. That's what I'm saying. The smartest the smartest people be limited and stuff because they know, right? They gotta think of ways to, to to maneuver, and then you end up being smarter than everybody else. And then niggas look at you like, nah, nigga, you not smart, <laughs> but you really is. That's how it be, bro. That's really oh, bro. But yo, you know, I seen something on the internet, bro. Our perspective of things is mad weird. Like you ever you know you ever heard of, like that man the Mandela effect? Yeah. Like, like of, uh, like we think something it is, but it's really not. And yeah. we'd be thinking we're in like a different dimension or shift dimensions. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, Looney Tunes, like it's not spelled T-O-O-N-S. It's T-U-N-E-S, like tunes, like songs. Mm. Like really? you ever, Yes, that's how it's spelled, bro. I ain't bro. gonna lie, I didn't know that. And so like, wait, like songs? Why is it spelled like that? I don't know. Like you it's spelled like. singing songs? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> like it's not tunes like cartoons. It's tunes like T-U-N-E-S. And then you know, you know, uh, I think the Monopoly man, you know how they be saying he has a monocle. Mm-hmm. I don't think he has one. He doesn't. No. <laughs> he what do you mean no? Like he don't have one on his. Like I don't think there's a monocle on his face, bro. Let me see. I don't think he got one, bro. What do you mean he doesn't? He have does one? like the Monopoly man. So what have I been seeing? That's fake. What is? Hey, oh, I just been seeing Mandela something. effect, bro. I've been seeing something that's not really there. It's the Mandela effect. He don't got, look. He don't got a mon. He don't got the little thing on his eye. Bro, that's cap. Bro, I'm that's... telling. You. And you know Pikachu. They be thinking. All right, don't even tell me no cap about Pikachu. All right, it's not, it's not even nothing max. It's not even nothing max. Like you know, like Pikachu don't got a tail or something, bro. Like, nah, you all right. He he does. All right, what what color? Like bro, what color is his tail? Yellow. It is is the you know they think like the back of his tail is like black and shit. Bro, don't it's not tell black. Me it's not black. It's not bro, black. It's black. No, it's, it's not. brown or something. No, it's not, bro. It's so his yellow. Tail is just yellow. Yes. Yo. And look, look. I have another one that's gonna freak bro, you I out. I used to play all the Pokemon. Exactly. Bro. I still play it, bro. What? Bro, look, this is one's gonna freak you. I'm not gonna lie. It freaked me the the fuck out, bro. You remember the the ice cream trucks that we used to like the little. The ice yeah. cream trucks. You know how they used to have like the little popsicles. Yeah. Remember there was like Dora boots. Yeah. Sonic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You remember the boots one? I think so. Yeah. There wasn't a boots one, bro. I swear to God, but I promise you, I remember eating a boots one. Like, hold on, bro. Like that shit was it? Wait, like, there is a cap because no. that nigga had that nigga has the eyeballs and no. stuff. You could eat the gummy <laughs> eyeballs, bro. You not Yo, about to tell me there was no boots one. It was never that was never a thing, bro. But you'd swear that there was a boots one, right? I think I just been lied to. No, but like, I think that I no, I promise you, <laughs> in my mind, bro, I see a boots one. I yo, like hold on. Bro, I know what that nigga looks like. Exactly. So you know I'm about to, Bro, I know what it looks like. I can draw it if I was a good look, artist, bro, bro. It would look like this. It looked like this, right? Bro, that's it. That didn't never existed, bro. Isn't that scary? No, nah, I'm not gonna lie. That's not <laughs> creepy, bro. <coughs> that's not that's not insane. My head just is in another I world. I swear right I now. thought I seen that, bro. I promise you, they didn't have bro, one. I'm still not off the Pikachu one. <laughs> that's crazy Pikachu don't nah, got the it Monopoly man Nah that's all Max I don't even <laughs> That's what I'm saying <coughs> People say it's just like We look at something And then like automatically Think like what it is And just don't like Look very much into it But And other people be thinking like Oh we shift dimensions And we're in another dimension I don't believe in I don't think about all that But I think it's just like A mis- misunderstanding of information Yeah But that it's... popsicle one Is scary Cause that's nah, exactly that's... How I thought it looked but that was never a thing. That's actually like that crazy. was drawn out of somebody's imagination. But I swear, I thought I seen that shit, bro. That's what I'm saying. Hey, hey, bro. I don't know. I'm I... questioning my my life at this. <laughs> <laughs> Your head spinning, bro. Yeah. Hey, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I think I think I want. I think I need to do some psychology. <laughs> I think I think I want to. I might minor in that. What in psychology? Yeah. That's tough though. 
But don't be a yo. Oh no, actually, be a psychiatrist. Psychiatrist? Nah, hell no. Nah. I ain't gonna lie. Then uh, I can't be a psych. I feel like I'll psychiatrist. Know, I know a lot about my mental, but I ain't. Be, I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I love my peoples, but I'm not, I'm not helping no people that need help. I'm not gonna lie because, bro, because, bro. Besides doctors, besides actual surgeons, yeah. Besides those people, I feel I like think psychiatrists that's, are that's scams, one of the hardest though. jobs. I mean, yeah, it, I mean, yeah. You know, some people could be scumbags and stuff, you and know? just be like saying some BS, like, "Oh, you got depression." Definitely, but like, nah. Some people that. The psychiatrists that really work with the crazy people. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They gotta like, be nah, certified. bro. I be seeing them shows and stuff. How the psychiatrist, bro. I seen this one show. This little, little kid, bro. She was like thirteen, crazy ass little girl, <laughs> crazy as hell, bro. She like showed up like late to one of her psychiatrist meetings. Yeah, bro. Like, she showed up like, like trying to like. Kill the lady on like some like stab her with like a pen type yeah, shit. Yeah, like crazy. Like, like nah, I'm gonna have to. You gonna have to see me with that. That's what know. I'm saying. Though. Like know, they be bro. having to deal with people's like people that really don't know how to deal with their own like mind and stuff. And then you of course got people that just need you know a like somebody bit of to help. talk to. Yeah, just need somebody to talk. Yeah, to. I understand that. But but your mind is a scary place. But I ain't yeah, gonna nah. lie. But that's that's what most people be. Be getting caught up just in their mind. Yeah. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. You wanna know what's crazy though? What? Like, it's not gonna be off topic, but like, nah, go crazy. I ain't bro. gonna lie. Ever since I I started smoking though, like, yo, I be reading hella stuff. Like, yo, bro, they be saying that people that smoke, bro, don't really be having like, like dreams. And yo, I'm not gonna cap to you. <laughs> I'm not going to cap to you right now. I really can't remember, like... The last dream you had? Yo, like... Not even, like, a nightmare or something, bro. Like, I really, like... Is like, it, like... Like, bro, like, I just go... I just go to sleep, and I really just sleep. Like, I really... just And you I, just wake up? Yo, there'd be hella stuff I'd be reading about when I'd be smoking and stuff, and I'm like, yo, that shit really, like, has happened. Like, for me, bro, like, my dreams, low-key, is, like, how I have deja vu moments. Yeah, yeah. Like, that too. That never happened to you. After? Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely. That's why I'm saying dreams. Dreams be crazy. Like though. with my mom, right? So my mom be having dreams. Like she dreams of the same thing every day, and it's like her on a beach. And say like there's a. And it's the same thing every day. And like when the dream's over, she wakes up. It's at the same time. But like, if say like a storm comes over, or something bad happens in the dream. She knows like she's that means she overslept, and then she mm. automatically wakes up. See, that's crazy. That's that's one of those cases where I feel like somebody's like low key controlling. Like she's controlling. Yeah, that. like she learned how to control her dreams. Like I ain't never done that before. That's that takes like I don't know what that takes. That takes like some serious. I think in the mind meditating type. I think I it's called know. like lucid dreaming. Like I tried to practice that one time. I'm not gonna but lie. How the how do you practice? It's that? like you gotta lay you gotta down be half sleep or something. It's like, like you gotta lay down in your bed and you gotta do like breathing things. And like you gotta be mad still, and you have to. It takes like weeks to practice, I guess. But like it, it's kind of scary. I'm not gonna lie, because it feels like your body feels mad loose, but it just like you just want to open your eyes because you feel like something's like coming like this over your face. Oh no, nah. but nah, for real though. Like when I said about that smoking stuff, like like you bruh, really don't remember the last bruh, dream you I had. I go to sleep and I just I dead ass just go to sleep and sleep. Like I don't. <laughs> I swear I can't remember unless. Like that you just forget? Unless I had something, unless I had something serious on my mind, like I've been thinking about something for a minute yeah. or I'm thinking about somebody or something, bro, I'm not, I'm, I haven't had a dream in like so fucking long. Hey, bro. You know, you know. But they, like I'm low key fine with that though because <laughs> I used to be having weird ass dreams. Like, like, I don't like, know, just like crazy dreams. Like sometimes like the world be ending or like. If I watch something crazy, mm. like I would... Like a movie? Yeah, or... Bro, when we used to watch them weird-ass YouTube videos, like I would low-key have dreams about like certain scenarios of like Us crazy and- shit happening. <laughs> like like that shit like would that. turn into my dreams. I'm not saying it would be nightmares and stuff, but like... It's just weird. Yeah, just like my thoughts be turning into my dreams. But like ever since I've been like 
like smoking a little bit and stuff, like, nah, I really just be going to sleep and just be slumped. Are you like, serious? I don't remember nothing. Like, is it like, I hope it's not like those times that like, you ever went to sleep and wake up like five minutes later? I was talking about this with Jason. Like, you ever, or like you go to sleep and it feels like you're sleeping for like five minutes and then you wake up, it's, it's like, it's been like 10 hours. You're like, whoa, what the fuck? Like, it feels like I haven't been sleeping for that long. Like, you ever had that before? Uh, yeah. Like, it's yeah. like quick ass yeah. sleeps. And like, you just close your eyes, you wake up, it's like the morning. I'd be so pissed. They used to happen yeah, to me in nah, high school. That that don't happen to me that much because I'd be, I be trying to wake up and stuff now. But yeah, yeah that yeah, used yeah. to happen to me a I lot. I used to hate them shits, bro. But dang, that's crazy. Yeah, no, maybe, that shit. Maybe you're just dreaming during the day. Like, in reality, that's why you don't dream no more. Because they be, be saying... about that, too. They be saying, like... <laughs> I be thinking about that, too, because, like... Like, yeah, when, when they say, oh, like, you know how your teachers be like, what you doing? You... You daydreaming, daydreaming or some yeah. shit? I'd be like, yeah, nigga, I actually am. <laughs> <laughs> some random shit would really... Like, that's what I'm saying. Random shit be popping it up, like, in my head during the day and stuff. Bro, random stuff. I always think of random stuff all the time, bro. But, yo, what was that thing you was telling me before about them video games? This is mad random. Oh, that motherfucking, um... The metaverse stuff. Yeah, tell me about that, because that sounds <clears throat> crazy. All right, so I don't know too much about it myself, but long story short, you know that that Ready Player One game, right? You know how the movie, yeah, 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 and it was that was how it was about a video movie. game. Yeah, nah, I ain't gonna. That was my favorite video game movie I ever seen. Facts, that shit. Like, it was a good movie, and it was just mad lessons and stuff, mm-hmm. and in general. But anyways, so you know how it was in the game. It was like a a futuristic virtual world, world. they lived in, right? They lived in a futuristic world before that, but like to play the game, it, it was like you way had more to, advanced. yeah, like you put on the thing and it sent you to a whole nother world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, what I heard with this metaverse is is like, who made it? I heard that guy from Facebook is working on it. The nigga that made Facebook, what's his name? Zimmerman. Is yeah, his name? Zuckerberg. No. Zuckerberg. 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 Bro, I heard he's making, he's helped making it. And it's like, it's gonna be what that player one stuff is like really because you know we're 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 almost already there with uh that virtual reality stuff like mm-hmm. you know we put Technology's it on and up. we seem like we're in another world but mm-hmm. like that metaverse thing is gonna actually be like a world yeah like uh that ready player i don't know how to explain is it, it like that a ready player like you're gonna wear goggles or you think you're gonna have like a full body suit i you don't know it? i feel like it's gonna be probably even more simpler than that it's mm. probably they're gonna probably gonna be like yo Take this little chip and like put it in your body or something, and then turn it on. And if you want to go into the verse, but I heard he's close to it too. He's close to doing it. That's tough. That's that's, like, that's low key tough. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I think it is tough, but I feel like that shit's about to be maximum. Yeah, I'm like, gonna copping. Be, that that Cop- might be the start of like some some weirdness though. Like, hey, bro, uh, robot apocalypse. But bro, that shit is. That shit is crazy though, because bro, do you remember how Ready Player One went, bro? Like, yeah, I know it went nigga, downhill. If, if you didn't make it out, nigga, you was really like dying in the game. <laughs> At certain points, you was yeah. really, you could really die, like, bro. They was using like the bread, like actual bread. That's what I'm saying. Like, that's crazy. Like, nah, bro. That's bro. What if you go in there and you can't come out, like? Oh, like you get trapped in there, like freaking um, like like I'm low key scared about that. And they said they mad close, yeah, like on some spy kids type stuff. Like just get stuck in there, and like I don't know how how you gonna get out of there. Like I feel like see if we're going in that that direction, that might be bad for the next generation of kids. Cause like so I'm saying we gonna end up like gonna go in there and get lost, get lost. They never gonna want to get out. They gonna be playing Mario and just never come back, bro. Like they're gonna be they're gonna be stuck on level one of Mario and just I'm like not, never come back. I'm not gonna lie. If they figure out how to do it, that's like another way they can control us, bro. Like they could low key like if you control us like our mind like that is crazy. Right, that's like that what's it called? I forgot I seen that podcast, that Rick and Morty episode when that nigga made that little world. Yes. Inside that that's basically Wait, was it the it the world inside the the That cube shit? Or yeah, it was like his um his like engine. They, oh, um, it was his engine? Yeah, yeah, his engine died, and he walked in. He ran into the. Bro, that shit was a whole universe. Exactly, controlling his bro. Dang engine. Yeah. Like that could be us, bro. Like just imagine you put that shit on, and they could like control your mind, and you just doing hella random shit. And you just think it's you. And exactly, it's not. and like plus, 
If kids just doing that, they're not gonna be going outside. They're gonna start getting fat. Like you remember watch Wally, bro? Remember, Yo, remember Wally Wally was really ahead of his time. It was I didn't really bro. understand that movie until years <laughs> later because nah, I was small when that movie came yeah, out. Yeah, it was like so. it came out in like two thousand seven, like two thousand eight, something like that. I'm like, yo, the world just looked like shit right now. That's all I'm thinking about. And I'm like, who is this little ass robot just trying to find a plant? Yeah. Like showing these people a plant and like it's I a just bunch thought of... it was a cool movie, but then nah, I really bro. understood that shit. I was like, yo, Wally is Max. Bro. He's Max, bro. He he went to go up you remember the people in the spaceship that was like fat? fat as fuck. Yes, bro. Nobody that's... was in shape. That's what's gonna be like us if we had them little body suits, bro. Bro, they were just floating around on dang them boards all day long. Them boards, them freaking <laughs> little hover hover chairs, bro. Whatever. Yo, that's crazy, bro. Like, uh, and then the robot started tweaking. They tried to try to violate them. And exactly, stuff. man. Movies, yo, I'm telling you, movies show a different nah, side of they, things, bro. They the truth. They the truth. You ever, you ever watch that movie? Um, cause I know you be watching hella movies. Yeah. Bro. You ever watch that movie, The Green Inferno? The Green Inferno. I don't know if you ever watched that movie. That shit is sick, bro. If it you, sounds familiar, but the one where if, it, if it's sick, I probably didn't watch it. Because I would remember some crazy ass It's shit. the one where the people, it's like a group of college kids, they're going into the rainforest to stop people from um, cutting down the trees. And they go into the Amazon. And then they crash. Their plane crashes in the middle of the Amazon. And then a, the group of indigenous people find them. Oh, yes. yeah, yeah. Bro. I didn't know what that movie was called, but yeah. It was like, that's what I'm saying, though. Like Stuff like that, like that shit is really real. Exactly. Like They really got... Places where you can't the, go. the native people will really slice your ass up. That's what I'm saying, bro. Put like you, they will make you a shush kebab, bro. For real, <laughs> they will turn you into a shush kebab, bro. and just leave you on the sand. That's just yo. You ever like there was an island in India? I forgot like by India. Yeah, and like you can never go in there. Yeah, the native people they will literally kill you, bro. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And like there was like a group of fishermen that ventured off a little too far. Like they was fishing. Bro, I think I seen. And like I they fell asleep. That. And when they woke up, they just got arrowed, bro. Like boom, boom. And then the the helicopter tried to come get their bodies because they was I dead already. And they was throwing it at throwing them, right? at the helicopter. I'm like, yo, this cr-, like that's like, what I'm saying. They'd be like, yo, no talking, it's just straight, just straight, get out of bro, here, bro. Like think about it, bro. Like there's different worlds in this world. Cause like, see, me and you, we have like technology. We know about TikTok, Facebook, all that stuff. Those people don't even know. They living back in like the the BCs, bro. Nah, they still. Yeah, like that's, that's why crazy. When you, when you were saying uh, about the national park and stuff, like they be having parts even in the U.S. Mm-hmm, like the Native that, Americans. Yeah, they just yeah, it's it's literally they got their own like land and stuff, and it's they're they're away from the public, kind of like the the Amish people. Yeah, like, but even those people, they be coming to the towns, you know, to yeah. get food and stuff. Those people don't. Nah, nah, that the natives they they don't come at all. They, they stay. They, they don't stay even in leave. There. Yeah, they stay in the. They place and mm-hmm. stuff. Have you ever watched the show on Netflix called The Inside Job? Uh, no. Nah, what's that? It's like it's a show. It's like um, it's like an adult show, like adult cartoon, like Big Mouth, but it's like for conspiracies. Mm. That's just fire. What it's is it called? Inside Job. Inside the Job. Inside Job. That's just fire. Yeah, I'm gonna need to watch that. Yeah, it's on. It's like I think the creative Gravity Falls made it because it looks like Gravity mm, Falls. Yeah, Gravity Falls was that weird shit, but Gravity Falls was lit though. It was lit. So it's like a it's like an older spot. version of Gravity Falls. That's what it is. Oh uh, yeah, no, nah, that's that's probably gonna be my. This is valid, bro. And plus, there's another show coming out for Adult Swim. It's called Pibby. Pibby. Yes. Nah, this shit sounds fire, bro. Pibby. That shit sound like some some little kid movie. It, <laughs> yo, it's a little kid show. So say, so it's a little kid show. Like they're teaching about shapes and like numbers. Uh-huh. But then a big ass virus comes into the world. Like and some it's, COVID type shit? It's like, it's like a, no, computer virus. Oh. So it's like coming in, it's like following and Pibby. And like, so she's jumping around like different shows. Like she's going to like Billy and Mandy, Scooby-Doo. And like that virus is coming and taking over them shows too. And this is fucking them it's up. It's like, yeah, it's fucking them up. And then at the end, she takes like a whole bunch of people from different like old Cartoon Network shows like Scooby-Doo, Dexter's Laboratory, everybody, like Camp Lazo, all of them. And they have like a big ass battle at the end, like freaking Avengers. Yo, that shit sounds heat, Wait, bro. It's it's gonna be on what? It's gonna be I on. Think it's on Cartoon Network. Like you know how Cartoon Network. At it's the on end. Cartoon Network right now. No, I think it's coming out next year. Wait, is it? It's gonna be a kids show? Or no, it's an adult. It's Adult, adult swim. swim. That's what I'm saying. Oh. That shit heat, bro. Oh yeah. That shit about to be some. That sounds fucking... funny as hell. I can't. 
I can't remember the time. Like there don't be there don't be too many. <clears throat> I don't be watching cartoons nowadays. You know. Yeah. Niggas is old now and shit. But well, I like, watch the adult besides, swim cartoons. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Besides like uh, Rick and Morty and a, bun- and Morty a bunch of a bunch of old uh, Adult Swim cartoons. I don't be watching too many, too many cartoons like that. Mm. To be honest, it'd be like that though. We we at no, that, that age, bro. That, that shit sounds funny though. That shit sounds fire. I'm about to watch that shit though, bro. But this is one last segment, bro. I don't know if you watch the podcast, but we do pick a side here. So I'm All gonna right. ask you. So this correlates to the. To the um that Green Inferno movie, bro. So, uh-huh. what situation do you think you'll be able to survive in? If somebody, so, so the question is, which one do you have a better chance of living in or <clears throat> getting out of a situation where somebody where you get kidnapped, or if you stumble across an indigenous tribe like the ones we were talking about, like those people that kill people, and they trap you. Like, which one do you think you can survive? Man, I'm gonna be honest with you, right? But now. with the tribe, you have like a weapon. You get a gun. I ain't gonna lie. You can be the motherfucking. You can be, <laughs> bruh. You can be motherfucking. What's that nigga from fucking uh, GI Joe? That motherfucking nigga that was nice with the swords. Uh, Snake Eyes. Snake Eyes. Yeah. Bro, you can be that. You can be that nigga, and the niggas with the other skills have all that in one person, bruh. Promise you, you not making it off that island, bruh. You serious? Bruh, <laughs> them people. I'm telling you, as smart, as smart as we think we are, for leaving them alone, bro, bro, them people were there for Those centuries. Those are like the first people, probably. Oh yeah, like, they definitely are the first people, like ever, bro. Mm-hmm. Like they probably been there since they seen everything. They probably seen slavery. They seen just they hella probably. crazy stuff. Like, bro, mm-hmm. they, they, even with the technology, you know, we might be able to take them over, but like. Bro, if it's just me, if it's just me by myself, bro, like they know they 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 territoried it, they island, like they know all the bad places. They yeah, can like just, they could just they, they will catch me lacking any second, like like they capture you I'll, already. Do you I'll, think you can escape? Like with a gun, you gotta. I'll give you a. Bro, I think you could give me a loaded arsenal, and I'm still not making it. Out. Like, <laughs> I'll probably but, you'll get through a lot of people. You know, you'll probably take out mad people and stuff. That's that's not the but point. Some but some random like, nigga with an arrow just gonna get your bro, ass. Somebody's gonna get you. Like the <laughs> smartest people, those people are really the smartest. Like they know, they know that there's other people out there that's more advanced than them, or think that they're more mm-hmm. advanced than them. But like, yeah. The natural world itself, like they know, they know everything about it. They know how to, you know, cure stuff. They cure their own diseases, whatever they got. They, Facts. They know how to eat. They know how to survive, basically. That's so true. it's like, it's like me going into like somebody else's hood and like trying to get out of there. Yeah, or trying to mess with them. So you like, think you like could not hella people about to come out and beat my <laughs> ass or something, or shoot me or kill me? Or so something. you think you could survive? Like if somebody kidnapped you. Like in a basement type shit, like even that. That's that's pretty crazy too, because you don't know what that person is capable of. That person could be a mastermind. You might not make it out of that either. Mm. It no. could have you in a lockdown security, like jail type shit. <laughs> like you ever watch that but movie? I think um, what what movie? Uh, girl in the basement. Yeah, like that. He lock you with some shit like that. <laughs> I ain't going on. I I don't know, but I would rather I would rather be in a kidnapping situation than 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 living with or being with those people on another island, bro, cuz nah, nah I, I'm way too I scared think of that. That's, even if I had a gun, I think I'd be deed. But if I'm kidnapped, I'm saying I'm not going to I'm be the worst. I'm be shit myself. I'm yeah, be no, no, I'm I'm be, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm give I'm gonna give up a, f- a fight, but that's that's what I'm saying. I feel like when you get kidnapped, you know, the kidnappers they want that. Like they want they you to, want be like you that? to fight. They want you to be weird. They <laughs> want like, you to complain. Like they live off emotions. Like if you stumble upon a a random group of Native Americans, bro, they don't care about your feelings. They just want you dead and ASAP. Like they they eat your they, ass. they gonna kill you or torture you, like instantly like it's not about thinking about what they about to do to you like they know what they about to do they don't want you here as simple it's as that deep. like somebody kidnapping you is either trying to be dumb or weird or just just trying to do it just to do it that's facts though but i think i'll have a better chance at 
somebody kidnapping me. It's it's, <laughs> it's, it's deed for that. I know what you mean, bro. Uh, that's that's some sick shit, though. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. Kidnapping's already crazy. Like just, people can get kidnapped all the time, bro. Like every two weeks. Thinking about taking somebody and just just taking somebody in general, like bro. that's sick. And what you do, it's already deed. You can't give them back. It's yeah, over. Like yeah, you already no. <laughs> like yeah, it's no, over, it's, bro. It's super over. But you got any other things you want to talk about? Any conspiracies? Any topics you want to talk about? Anything random? Anything you want to say? You got questions? You want to ask me anything, bro? Bro, kind of like that. Like, bro, I remember when you first. I remember when you first told niggas about that Squid Game shit, bro. Um, what Squid Game shit? Like when you first told about Squid Game, was it you? I think you watched it first or some. I don't know. Somebody told me in the group chat a while ago about Squid Game, but like I'd be thinking about that a lot. Like if that was like, a real thing, like bro, people really be going into debt. I haven't finished Squid Games. I'm not gonna lie. I think I'm like the only oh, thing in the world. Yeah. yeah, but Jay nah. watched it, so I I already <laughs> know what happened. <laughs> yeah, nah, that shit is crazy. But like, I'd be working in, I'd be like fixing people's credit and stuff. Now. Yeah. So I'd be seeing like, and then when I just watched that movie, I was like, yo, like I'd be reading people's credit reports every day. Like niggas be messing their credit up so easily, mm-hmm. like the easiest stuff. And I watched that Squid Game shit. I'm like, damn, niggas is. Doing all this crazy shit just to get some bread, bro. That's what, like, honestly, niggas. It just shows that niggas do anything with money. That's facts, though. Like, think about it, bro. Like, any game show, bro. Niggas is on there if you just win money. Money makes the world go around, bro. Without money, yeah. there's nothing. That's crazy. Crazy thing. That little, that little dollar. That should control your whole life. It really does. That's just sad, bro. You think the. You think anybody, like, in the dark web, like, create, like, a little Squid Games type shit? Um, Like, not exactly Squid Games, but they have people fighting for their lives to either get out. Like, they kidnap. So, say, like, people on the dark web, like, they kidnap other people and they put them in the dark, uh, put them in, like, a game show and they fight to the death and Bruh, they put on the dark web. I think so. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if that's a thing. What is that? Hey, yo. My sh- started playing music. Oh, that scared yo. the hell out of me. Yo. Yo. yo what's up? With, what's up? Nah, I was like, I thought that was coming out the window. I'm like, is there some... Yo, what is this music? What music is that? I don't even know what this... Is that on your playlist? King, I don't know. King of Prussia? What is <laughs> this? Nah, I don't know what this is. That's not on your playlist? Bro, No. Yo, that's the government that telling us to weirdness. shut the fuck up, Yo, bro. I don't know what just happened, but that's the government watching us telling us to shut the Yo, fuck up, bro. This this episode was was too crazy. <laughs> my phone, <laughs> my phone started tweaking. Yo, but do you think do you think there's actually oh, like yeah, a thing that that shit? But. Bro, I think there is because, yo, what was that guy we used to watch that used to have that voice? Was it Chills or whatever? Something like that. Bro, like, bro, there's a movie on Netflix that literally. Was it talking about the dark des- web? Nah, it was described this thing, right? Like, yo, this guy went viral. But like he was on the chat. He was on he was on like the dark web. Long story short, he kidnapped like this judge, like this famous judge or somebody. Mm-hmm. And like, bro, he broadcasted it. And then like he- after like an hour, like the whole United States was like watching this nigga, and niggas did not know where he was. Really? And he had, like, this guy in the basement, and he was, like, torturing him and stuff. I think I think he, like, the judge that he kidnapped, like, put somebody away for a crime he that do. they didn't do. So he was, like, exposing him. But, like, oh. bro, the nigga was, like, torturing him, like, in front of, like, millions of people, like, in front this of the United States. This didn't happen, States. right? This is just a movie. Nah, it's a movie on Netflix. I oh. forgot what it's called. Damn, I'm lacking right now. But when That's I find tough. it, when I find it, I'm going to send it to you because it's, like crazy and then like they end up finding him before uh he like tries to to kill the judge and stuff but like long story short he did expose the judge the judge was wrong he didn't they ended up he ended up like showing the whole united states like he put he put this nigga away for like no reason no reason and stuff but like Mm. he was like broadcasting live and like torturing him like 
like the cops was watching like like what cutting his toes off type shit or like yeah just like stabbing him doing crazy stuff like oh, hell. he was broadcasting it mad people bro civilians and like <sighs> like uh the cops and everybody was watching like the government like it was just like he broadcasted it on like television type stuff like every screen that's like, some crazy shit bro i be i think that stuff does really happen on the dark web or it's just probably could we even go on the dark web yeah bro it's actually they said it's, it's actually really really easy to access like what do you just search up dark web or do you have to like nah, do some other you, extra you shit? download you literally you know how you got like safari and stuff oh you have to download it yeah but it's just like it's not a app or something it's like a browser and it literally like, do I have to, like, code some shit? Nah, it's literally, like, it's like a... Saf- Web browser. Yeah, it's oh, like like a Google or something. It's You you search in, it's called, like, a, a Tor browser or whatever. Oh, I never tried it, but... I don't want but to. The it's, government gonna get my ass. Yeah, but, like, Tell nah. They gonna put me on the watch list. Nah, it's, it's really meant for that. When they say, like, dark web and stuff, like, once you get in there, it's really, really, really hard to track you. Unless you put, like, you're... Like, that's, what, that's why they say, like... Before all this crypto yeah. and shit, that shit was really, it's been popping on the dark web. Like yeah. that's what they use to, to pay like people? pay people and stuff. Cause, oh. Cause you can't use your real money on the dark web. That's how you would get tracked and stuff. But like, yeah. like if you was to, if we was to go on the dark web right now, all we have to do is put in the browser and stuff. And like it, it puts up like so many firewalls. It's really hard to get like to track unless you put your information on it and stuff. Mm, that's scary. Like, it's really easy to access, though. That shit's crazy. I don't think... I'm never going to do that. They're going to put me on the watch list, bro. Yeah, nah. It's that's it's a different world. Ah, it really is. That shit's crazy. I think that's a good way to end the episode before we get canceled. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, no cap, though. No before cap. Before the government start calling my phone. Hold on. <laughs> nah, they be doing that, though. They be right. calling like if you if you I don't answer no phone calls. I'm not going to lie. I don't either, I don't answer but none. That'd be scary, I'd be bro. I'd be waiting for if it's that important, niggas going to leave me a message, bro. <laughs> like and half the time nobody be leaving me messages, so facts, I know it's facts. not important. That's facts. Or if it's not, they could text me like it's done it's, up. It's done up, it's done up. But I think this I think that's a good way to end the episode, bro. Shout Hell out to you, my yeah, brother. Bro. Thank you for pulling up for another ep- for a good episode, bro. It was Liddy, bro. And Yo, for all the people, man, follow us at No Regulars Podcast on YouTube. Subscribe. I think we got like 130 subscribers right now. 135. We going up. Only way is up. Only way is up. You know what I'm saying, bro? Only way is up. Yo, follow us on No Regulars on TikTok. No Regulars dot podcast on Instagram. We almost at 10K, bro. I think we're going to hit 10K after this video, though. Hell yeah. Yes, sir, bro. I told you. With this podcast, all the members, we all going up, bro. Hell yeah, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's Liddy. It's, it's only Liddy. But, you know what I'm saying? Thank y'all. Shout out to y'all, man. If y'all like the video, uh, like the video, comment, subscribe, hit the post notifications, all that. Oh, follow us on Spotify, No Records Podcast, and Apple Music coming soon. Still lacking, but probably this week. Soon, Sorry. Soon, soon. Apple Podcast. Hold on, guys. It's coming. It's coming, but. It's going to be lit. I know, right? Yeah. Almost there, bro. We're going to get there, but. Yup, yup. We different, they regular, no regulars, man. Gangster. I'm gonna really go get it. I'm gonna really go get it. I'm gonna really go get it.